All right. Hello, everyone. Hope you're having a great day. And uh, hope you have a great rest of the week coming up. Wanted to do a quick video. This is the newest Venom Linux. And if you're not familiar with Venom Linux, Venom Linux is a source based distro, it's rolling release. And this is the latest incarnation of Venom. And I absolutely love it. It's an open box system, very minimal, very minimal. Uh, just waiting on you to add whatever you want on the system. It doesn't come with very much. So it's, you know, very much as far as applications that are pre installed. So Emmett, the developer, is leaving it up to you to uh, decide what you want on your system. Now it does come with some basic tools like, you know, how to change your themes and uh, it's got PC Man FM, G parted. The only terminals are X term and UX term. And a few settings here. Other, that's my, that's all my stuff right there that I'm using FF play uh, in order to play my uh, uh, music collections. Network, get Firefox. Multimedia, now I added this awesome mixer right here. I added screencast and I added webcam. <laughs> I am keeping this as minimal as I can. I'm actually doing this video with FFmpeg and that's what this screencast right here is. I could open my webcam but I'm not going to. Development, you get Genie and under accessories, oops, uh, L3 I'm just going to call it leaf pad. That's like the uh, continuation of leaf pad since leaf pad stopped development. And you get PyCom. All right, so we looked at network and all we have is Firefox. And there's no way to connect to your wireless network. Oh dear. Or is there? Yes, the background has changed. I have a, I have it set to change every five minutes. There is actually a very simple method of connecting to your wireless internet. <clears throat> Excuse me. I was a bit perplexed at first myself, and so I did a search. Let me see if I can pull that up. Now you'll have to forgive me. I don't know how to increase the font size in X term. The normal way of increasing fonts uh, doesn't work. So I did a scratch search network. That's what I did. All right, let's see. I think that got all of it. All right. I know it's hard to see, but anywhere there's a little green star right there, that means that's what's installed. So I'm going down through here. Oh, Network Manager is installed. Hmm, okay. Network Manager applet is not installed. So what I did, I thought, okay, Network Manager is installed. So I opened up the File Manager. Now the way I do things is a little different than other people. I, op I opened up the File Manager and I uh, went to User Bin. <clears throat> Well, let me just go ahead and do that. Just to show you what I did. I went to the file system, went to user, bin, and this is going to take a minute for everything to open. I have to say, Emmett has done a fantastic job. I think, for me personally, this is his best release so far. So I went down where Network Manager would be where it would be, where it would be. There we go, we're getting there. All right. And you see there's no network manager, blah, 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 but you come on down a little bit more. There we go. Here we are, NM, NM, that's network manager. And I noticed 
NMTUI. So I thought, let's just try that. <laughs> so I opened up the terminal and typed in NMTUI. <gasps> oh dear, look at that. <laughs> Now, I have already activated, uh, the same day I installed this, I had already activated my wireless connection. But we have this nice little incurses window here where you can edit a connection. It's just like having the regular GUI. It's just an incurses. Activate a connection. So you would want to click on that. And you would want to come down here to your Wi-Fi. And when you click that, it will ask you for your password and I think maybe it says activate I can't remember but that's all you need to do and then you can come back here to, on your keyboard and hit tab go to back and scroll down to quit and you'll be connected so that's it I just wanted to do this quick video just to uh, maybe help some people that may have been trying this and they have no idea what to do it's actually very simple that's all you need to do open up your terminal type in nmt the letter t as in tom nmtui and that's all there is to it connects right away no big deal all right there you go you guys have a great day and emmett if you see this Thanks, man. It's fantastic. Absolutely love it. All right. You guys take care. Have a good day. Thanks.